Hey guys, my name is Jamie. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do a horizontal linearity that is a part of our equipment qualification series. A little bit about me, I'm a UT level 2 as well as a phase array level 2. Let's go ahead and get into it. For this video, I'll be using a sonic test wave, a DS block, and a one inch transducer. Start out, go ahead and press default imperial, bring the range to 20 inches because for a horizontal linearity, you must have a range of 20 inches. What I'm going to go ahead and do, I'm going to go ahead and use the auto cal feature. I'll use the 2 inch section and I'll also use 20 inches. Change the range to 20 again. The reason I'm using 2 inches is because I'm using the 2 inch section on the DS block as seen behind my hand. So, I'm going to go ahead and bring that section that is in between the two white lines on the 2 inch mark. Go ahead and add that point. Go to the 20 inch mark now. Add the point, press calibrate, and apply. So now I'm at 2.01. I'm just going ahead and looking at the numbers to make sure they are close. And as you see, they're all fairly close. So now I'm going to go ahead, pull up the form to do the equipment qualification, and input those numbers that is within the gate. So for the first section, we have the 2.001, the second signal is the 3.996, the third signal 5.992, fourth signal 7.984, and you see on the top left that is going to be in the actual reading section, and on the left you'll see reflector dimension in inches, so that's the 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, so it's all the multiples of the 2 inch signal. and it will automatically calculate the percentage of screen range and it'll get tell you and you have to be within plus or minus two percent of the full screen width all right so now we're on 16 so 16.013 17.992 and as you see we are nowhere near that plus or two minus two percent and it's fairly right on 19.987 i mean that's about as close as you can get that is going to conclude our horizontal linear calibration. If you'd like to learn more info about what we do, check out firstchoicende.com. And I hope this video helped.